survive 100 days in the future in hardcore Minecraft. It all began when Commander Beckbro Jack sent me this urgent message. Josh, the Minecraft universe is under attack by Cycle. They're going to destroy everything in approximately 100 days unless you stop them. There's only one problem. In this simulation, you won't remember who you are or why you're there. Sounds dangerous. I'm in. And just like that, I was on a mission to save the entire Minecraft universe. The commander was right, I didn't remember a single thing once I arrived, but luckily enough, a villager couple was kind enough to adopt me. And I lived a fairly normal string of code as well, for the most part, until I saw this talking mushroom, and well, that's when my adventure... Whoa, whoa. So I stumbled upon this strange block not too far out from my village. And then all of a sudden the world just turns blue. I couldn't see anything, but I could feel myself becoming weightless. I, I, w I was floating. Ah! Just like that, all I saw was darkness. Next thing I know, I'm in a room with the Psy Golem Chief Commander. The Psy Golems are a new advanced species of golem that evolved from the Iron Golems after the Singularity. Sadly, they have no emotion, making them extremely hostile and dangerous. Yeah, these dudes are evil, and they're after this weird ore, it's called like go gobbler or so, I don't know, it's weird, but we'll talk about that later. He approached me with this weird needle. I, I yelled and screamed, but no one was there to help me. Next thing I know, he injects me with whatever mysterious fluid was inside, and, and then all of a sudden, I, I get super dizzy, and I, I feel the blood of a million creatures course through my veins. It, it felt like I lived 10,000 lifetimes, all within the span of a single second, and then, boom! blacked out again. All of a sudden, I wake up to the sound of TNT going off. Next thing I know, this weird shadow guy figure and, and robes comes out of nowhere, and then he starts shooting the golem with his plasma cannon. Oh, where are you going? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I guess I better follow him. Oh, no, there's mobs down here. Oh, no. I'm in hardcore. Oh, oh I gotta run. Wait up. Wait for me. Oh, no. What? Debug tool, book and quill. I picked these up from the ship. You have been set free from the tyranny of the Psy Golems. Unfortunately, now that you have been injected, they won't stop hunting you. However, you now have the power. Stop them before it's too late, Morpheus. Yes, Roland. What? Oh! Oh no. Okay, what is going on? Okay, I need to get back to the village. They're gonna freak out and they're totally not gonna believe me when I tell them what happened to me. Confused, afraid, uncertain, all I could think about was getting back to my home village. This was my first encounter with Psy Golems, and it definitely wasn't my last. Leave me alone, you stupid- ah! Wait, 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 what? Uh, Mom? Dad? No! 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 I'm gonna die! I was in complete shock. Everything I had ever known, gone. J just like that. Mommy! This video is sponsored by Dragon City. Dragon City is a free-to-play mobile game that is available on all devices. You can download the game by clicking the link in the description or scan the QR code and get a special free starter pack of 15,000 food, 30,000 gold, and a Flame Knight Dragon. You can collect thousands of dragons with different elements and rarities and build your own dragon empire. You'll need to collect things like food, gold, and gems so you can grow and tailor your city to reach new levels. In order to grow your flying empire, you'll need to breed two dragons and get new dragon eggs, hatch them, and feed them to evolve. Then train your dragons, teach them new attacks, and take them to battle in order to make them even more powerful. One of my favorite parts is the PvP fights and the combat and arena fights where you can challenge your friends and other Dragon Masters. You can also become a member of an alliance and interact with other Dragon Masters and join exclusive events where you unlock the chest with awesome rewards. Join the battle pass and the weekly mini games where you can claim daily prizes and dragons. And I think you guys will enjoy this the most. You can actually find dragons of your favorite YouTubers as a part of the office and also from breeding and the mini events and the Dragon Shop. Yeah, they have like Darman, the, the Do, Dream, and George Not Found Dragons and more. It's sick. Download the game by clicking the link in the description or scan the QR code to get a special free starter pack of 15,000 food, 30,000 gold, and the Flame Knight Dragon. Still mourning the loss of my village, I did the only thing I could do. Keep pushing forward. I scrounged up whatever leftover resources I had from the village and did my best to prepare myself for the journey I had ahead of me. And this is when so things sorry, get chicken. really weird. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> I'm, a chi I'm, a, I'm a chicken! I only have two hearts too! I'm gonna die! Ah, this feels so weird! I don't like it! Whee! That, that's the only cool thing. Yeah, after everything that's happened, the last thing I thought I'd have to deal with was turning into a chicken. Wait a second. If I eat this piece of chicken, does that does that mean I'm a cannonball? Okay, bad joke. I I'm sorry, okay? But really, I was actually freaking out on the inside. But I was a chicken on a mission, and that mission was to find a mysterious unknown man by the name of Aylwin. And so I, I grabbed my compass and began clucking my way towards the coordinates. There was actually a minecart station about a day's journey northwest, which had a track going in the direction of the coordinates. Yo, one ticket for the northwestern line, please. Mate, you're a chicken. Oh, listen, man, you don't know what I've been through, my boy. Just one ticket for the northern line, please. Here. Thank you, okay?
Well, you don't see that every day. And we're off! I was able to make great distance using the car system, but uh, eventually my luck ran out. Oh, 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 what? Dude, what is that? The Blackstone Golem? Is that, is that the village? I think we're almost there. How am I supposed to cross this? Actually, I have an idea. This is so risky. Here goes nothing. Oh, I gotta use my chicken powers, baby. Let's go. Next jump. Here we go. Yep. Strong! No, 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 um, okay, we gotta find Aylwin. Where's Aylwin? Does anybody know an Aylwin? Anyone? You? No? Ail Smith's shop. Oh, wait. Yes, Aylwin! I've been looking for you. These aliens just wiped out my entire village and killed everyone. And then some robot ejected me. And then some dude in robes told me to come and talk to you and find you. I have the chosen one. I've been expecting you. Wait, what? You you have? Yes, follow me. Okay. The Cyglums will not stop until all organic life on Earth is destroyed. But do you know why they do what they do? No, no, why? Ah, uh, the Cyglums themselves could care less about destroying organic life. They're all being mind controlled by a transmitter tower located in the Ender Realm, protected by a fierce dragon. Uh -huh. Excuse me, bro, we're trying to talk here, but who's controlling it? Uh, that, my friend, remains a mystery. If only I knew. Listen, all I know is if you can take out that transmitter tower, the Cyglums will be set free and millions of lives will be saved. No, no way, bro. bro have you seen? I'm literally a chicken. <laughs> Son, you've been injected with lizard DNA, giving what? you the ability to morph into whatever creature you take the life of. And by the way, you can turn back into human anytime you want. You're kidding. <laughs> Wait. This guy. <laughs> you oh see, my I told gosh. you, I told you, buddy, I, this, I told what you. Is, this oh, is so buddy. weird. Aylwin, I don't like this, man, but all right. And just like that, I was faced with the task of saving the entire world. Oh, I, I was afraid, but I wanted revenge for what the Cyglums did to my family. Aylwin told me I needed to become more powerful if I was going to be successful in my mission to take bad? out the transmission tower. And not only do I have to defeat the dragon protecting it, apparently I need some sort of special mining tool to even get into the room where the transmitter is located. And the oh. mining tool is not cheap. Luckily, Aylwin said if I bring him the 12 diamonds it takes to make it, then you would craft it for me. He handed me some mining gear and sent me to the mines. Excuse you. Rude. Ah, here's the mines. Sweet. Ooh, she got a cute. Oh, okay, Dave. All right, this is it, Elwin. You here? All right, man, I'll catch you later. Thank you. Ah, here we go. Time to do some mining. All right, so we need 12 diamonds. Hopefully it doesn't take us too long to find those. We are on a mission. Let's go, diamonds, baby. Oh my gosh. Okay, we got four. You know what? I might as well just use these. Nine diamonds. Okay, I need three more. Yo, let's go. Oh, that's enough. We got 12. Sweet. All right, let's go talk to Elwin. Yo, Elwin, I got the diamonds. Here you go. Perfect. I'll get started on crafting you that mining tool. Sweet. Thank you. Elwin crafted me the mining tool and then gave it to me. Then he mentions that in order to get to the dimension where the transmitter tower was located, I would need to bribe the portal guardian troll with this rare golden ring that was rumored to be found in this ancient nether fortress. So, how do I find this nether fortress? You need to go west and find the witch of the hog's feast swamp. She'll get you into the nether, but once you're in, you'll be on your own. So, make sure you're prepared. All right, lad. Off you go and remember, the whole world is depending on you. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Hey, Thanks, Elwin. Thank you. See you later, man. Oh, I'm so nervous, but here goes nothing. And just as I was making my way out of Avalon, I hear a bunch of explosions. Boom! 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 Avalon was under attack by the Cyglums. Elwin! No! I wanted to go back to help, but I knew it was too late. I I can't do this. I, I can't. I cannot do this. Life on. No, no, it's too much. Why me? Why? Oh, I'm just some orphan from a small village. It doesn't make sense. Listen, you understand one thing. Don't stop now, okay? It'll all be worth it, I promise. No, no, wait, 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 but... The Cyglums were clearly still after me. The world depended on me, so I decided to keep on going. I headed west and made my way to Hogsfield. Yes, okay, we need to be careful. This has got to be it. Okay, you got this. Knock, knock. Hello, any, anyone here? Oh, uh, hey, Miss, Miss, uh, Witch. I need help entering the nether. Can you help me? Oh, yes, my heart, you need to go. Yes, I can, but it's going to cost you. Okay, that, that's... Why don't you bring me one rabbit hide, diamond, and a rotten potato? Yes, yes. Okay, that sounds doable. All right, I'll, I'll be right back. Yo, she is creepy. What the heck? It took me literally three whole days to collect all the items the witch requested, but eventually I had everything right. she wanted. All right, Miss Witch, I got one rabbit's hide, a poisonous potato, and a diamond. There you go. Oh, perfect. It's perfect. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> ah, let's go! 
Where am I? Oh my, oh my gosh. Well, looks like I was exactly where I was supposed to be. Now, I'm not sure if I was ready to be here, but here I was. All right, this must be the fortress. Now, where in the world could that ring be? <gasps> oh no, there's wither skeletons. I gotta be careful. I'm gonna use my bow. No, stay away. Ooh. No, wait, wait, no. Oh, oh no, oh no, I'm gonna die. <gasps> I'm a wither skeleton. <laughs> Yo. Oh. Got a chest, food, another chest. Yo, a diamond. Okay, wait, now that I'm a wither, will this dude attack me? No way, no way. They don't care because I'm wither. Amazing, the other wither skeletons didn't attack me because I looked like one. This was going to be super useful later on. There's the ring. Oh, this does not look easy to get to though. Okay, I could turn into a chicken and just fly across, but then I'd only have two hearts. I could just build. I'm gonna try build. Wither skeletons lava proof. I'm scared to find out. Right, here we go. Nice and easy here. Okay, I'm a little nervous. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Whew. It seems a little too quiet. All right, perfect. Let's go. We got it. Yo, what the heck? Oh my gosh. Wait, turn the magma ring on. What is this? A blood baker. No. Where do I go? Where do I go? Build. I build. No! Oh my gosh. I'm fireproof. Let's go. Get my bow and run. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Yeah, that was actually pretty easy. Oh my, what the heck, bro? Okay, no, I've got to go. This is, that does not look, oh! No, 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 no. Okay, maybe I try to shoot it? Oh, this thing's gonna kill me. This thing is gonna kill me. No one mentioned anything about a mother demon, no! Okay, go, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I'm out of here. I am out of here. What the heck? Yo, that thing came out of nowhere. Okay, I got the ring though, right? Yes, okay. Woo! Okay, I'm alive, I'm fine. Everything's good. All right, I need to get back to that portal. I went through the portal and it teleported me to the middle of nowhere. So I set up a small camp for the night. I had successfully gotten the golden ring Elwin told me I needed, but the problem was I had no clue where the portal to the ender room was. And so I decided to head east until I found the nearest village. Maybe someone there knew? I don't know. <gasps> Is it the city? Hold on. <gasps> I think that's it. Oh my, yo, look at all those Psy Golems. What are they doing? The Psy Golems had taken over the city of Xenadrine. Xenadrine was built around Goblin War, which when smelted down and purified causes disruptions within its magnetic field, which is why Psy Golems needed it. They were using it to power their ships as well as boost the frequency transmitter tower. Oh man, these poor people. What could I even... I need to get stronger. That way it can actually help them. I decided to sneak into the city. I just, I had to help somehow. Just a little chicken. Don't mind me. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what the? I'm wanted? That's me! Yo, dead or alive? I mean, Alright, I need to wait. And now. Ooh, this could come in handy. Backpack. Might take that. Oh, and we got some loot in it. Sweet. An enchanted golden steak. Okay, let's grab some of this. Cooked rhino meat. What? Ooh, it's tasty though. What was that? Uh, maybe we should put this on. Finally clear up some inventory space. Put this on. Oh, yeah. Hopefully no one will recognize me. I waited until it was night when things were quiet and headed to the mines. I had an idea. Do, 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 do. It says chest. Oh, some TNT. Perfect. It's down there. I'm scared. I'm not going down there. Oh, there's the mines. All right, I got a plan. All right. Hopefully this stops him for at least a while. Okay, oh no, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no, I gotta run, better run, better run. Stop! I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. run. Someone said help me, help me. Oh no, this is not good. I wake up in Cyglum jail again. This time, though, things get a lot worse. I killed you, man. What? What? Who are you? What do you want with me? Ah, I can't. I can't get out. You are the heat part in our next evolution stage. What? What? Why me? <laughs> time to run some tests. What? No. No help. No. Ah! Ah! I was starved, baby, tortured, brainwashed for days. The weaker I got, the further I lost touch with reality. I could feel my source code becoming corrupted. I, I thought to myself, this is it. I, I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried. I tried, I tried, I tried, I tried. This is new? Josh. Oh, you again. I, am I dead? No, almost. You were giving up. Do you remember what mom said? Uh -huh. Listen, I can't keep saving you. It's messing up the timeline and it's getting dangerous. I've arranged for actors to open up a portal and scorch you out the sink. Good luck, Josh. 
Whoa, what? Oh, yo, who are you guys? Oh, oh, yo. Oh, thank you. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I need my stuff. I need my stuff. Wait, wait. It's in that chest. It's in that chest. Right there. Wait, right there. Oh, thank you. Let's go, you guys. Oh, yeah. It's like on everything. That's the debugger. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm almost done. It's gonna come in. Oh, yo, whoa, where am I? Yo, this is sick. Wait, who are you guys? The Pearl Hackers are part of the resistant effort to stop the cycle. We were sent to save you. Oh, okay, first of all, thank you. I, I thought I was going to die in that prison. I'm not going to lie. Listen, we don't have much time. The Cyclones are working on a plan to blow up this entire planet. Y you said what? Follow me. We're sending you to a top secret space station where you'll meet Dr. Yvonne the Hamburger. You said what? Listen, it's not safe for oh. you to be on Earth right now. This is crazy. The doctor's gonna take good care of you. Okay. All right. Here goes nothing. Ah, here I go. Oh my gosh, man. Bye, guys. The one. Ah. <laughs> it's my first time flying a spaceship. Kind of nervous. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. I got an ice in here. Yep. Oh, I'm in. I'm in, baby. Oh, oh my yo. gosh. The, the chosen one. Welcome. Welcome. Yo, what's up, doc? Oh, sorry, I forgot your name. What's uh, what's your name? It's Ivana Hamburger. No, no. <laughs> I asked, what's your name? Ivana Hamburger. Yo, wh what's your name, bro? Not what do you want to eat? Like, okay, we, we don't have much time. Follow, follow me quickly. I'm so confused. Okay. All right. All right. Take any weapon you Ooh. like. These are some futuristic weapons, man. Yes, yes. This one up here is personal favorite. Oh, this one. EFG Eternal. Yes. Oh, sorry. I probably shouldn't uh, point that at you there. That that <laughs> one do v very big damage. Apparently, Dr. Ivana Amberger, or whatever, is a former animal scientist who was stationed by the Ethereum government or something, and it was definitely the smartest person I'd ever met. He'd been living and working on the space station for over 20 years. That's a long time. This way. Th this way. Come. I must show oh, you. Oh, what do we got over here. Here, take these armors and these things. Oh. They will help you on your mission. These look nice. Also, take this in the iPhone. It will allow you to keep in contact with me while on your mission. Ah. Yo, sick! Very awesome! Nice, very nice. You are only hope that show some fun. I know, I know. Listen, th thanks for helping me. I feel a lot more comfortable now. Okay, you must get sleep. Tomorrow, you will be sent to, to find the portal of the Ender Realm. Goodbye. Bye, Dr. Ivana. To defeat the Cygolons and make sure they don't kill everybody. I made my way back to Earth and began my search for the Ender Portal. I didn't know where exactly it was, but I did get until that there was an Ender Biome southeast, and so I figured that was probably a good place to start looking. The snow's getting in my way. <gasps> Yo, I think this is it. There's a the village. Oh, it looks sick. Maybe someone there knows where to find this mysterious ender portal. I mean, I do remember, though, that ender people hate humans. So, uh, unfortunately, I think I'm gonna have to figure out a way to take out an enderman so I can transform into one. Oh, I feel bad about this, I'm though. Build a little shelter. Saw my dad do this once. Oh, here he comes. Shoot him. Which button? Here we go. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I just obliterated him. I just obliterated him. <gasps> okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, can we transform now? Yes. Enderman. Oh my gosh, that was insane. Okay, All right, let's see if we can find someone. Oh, hey, excuse me, Eli. I was wondering if uh, you know where the Ender Portal is to, to the Ender Realm. Oh, no, I don't, but I know someone who might. Ellie Kai, the Ender Elder of our oh, village. Okay. Follow me. Sweet. It's a nice town you guys got, by the way. And here, bro, how am I gonna fit, bruh? Excuse me. So, sorry. Sorry. Sorry to barge in, sir. Look, my name's Josh MV. I come from a small village that was destroyed by the cycle. And oh, dear son. I'm so sorry to hear that. Now, how can I help you? Well, I'm looking for directions to the portal of the Ender Realm. Uh, the Cyclones have completely taken over the Ender Realm. And you, you would be foolish to dance alone. I don't have a choice, sir. Just please, you know where the portal is? Um, I, I do sense that something special in you. Fine, fine. Here's the coordinates. Oh, right? yes, Be thank careful. You. By the way, I like that cool little eye thing you got going on. It's it's, it's, never, it's never mind. See you later. Got the coordinates. We're good. Ooh, I'm stressed right now, man. I am stressed. Yeah, I was starting to worry, but rightfully so. Things were about to get very wild. As I made my way towards the coordinates, for a brief moment, though, I felt a sense of peace. The birds were singing. There was a beautiful sunset, a nice breeze. I took in a deep breath and tried to savor the present moment as much as I possibly could. And as the sun slowly faded away, I thought to myself, 
how terrible it would be if the Cyclones were successful in their mission to destroy all organic life on Earth. I was not gonna let that happen. I, I couldn't. Finally, though, I was getting close to the portal to the end. We're almost to the coordinates. Somewhere around here. I think maybe down here. This has gotta be it. Okay, maybe I switch back to a human. There we go. Heal up a little bit. This place is dark. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's gotta be it. Okay, how do we get down? Okay. Oh, what does he got? Amethyst on him? And, oh! Ow! Oh, my foot. Okay, how do I get down there? Oh, he looks kind of scary. Here we go. Make our way down. Hey, yo, what's up? Uh, I was wondering if you could help me get to the Ender Realm. The Ender Realm's completely taken over by Cygol. Are you sure you want to go there? Uh, yes, sir. In fact, I'm actually the one who's gonna finally put a stop to them. <laughs> you? Yeah, yeah. Wait. Don't tell me you're the chosen one everyone's been talking about. Oh, no, we do. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't think I got it in me to stop them or what? <laughs> you look a bit scrawny if you ask me. But then again, what do I know? Listen, opening the portal to the Ender Realm is sacred and dangerous, so it's going to cost you. I've been looking for a warrior to steal an ancient golden ring from the Nether Realm. Oh, huh? yeah? You mean, uh, you mean this? No way. How did you? <laughs> uh, let's just say I got my ways, man. All right, here you oh, go. Yes. <gasps> yes. Good luck, kid. Thank you. All, all right. Whew, here goes nothing. Oh, go. Oh, my gosh, I'm here. Oh, this place is scary. <gasps> Look at all those cyclones. Okay, he gave me some good armor, though, so hopefully I'm strong enough to fight him. I got this gun, too. Sneak up on him. Right, here we go. Oh, my gosh. No, I'm getting shot. I'm getting shot. I'm gonna run out of ammo. Oh, oh I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I need to eat. I need to eat. I need to run. I need to run. I need to oh run. Oh, my gosh. This is not good. Ah, leave me alone. Come on, okay, hold on. I do not have much time. Hold on. No, 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 no. Oh, no, this is not good. This is not good. Oh, no, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I gotta get to this building. Uh, I thought my armor was supposed to protect me. Oh, this is not good. Oh, I should call Dr. Ivana. <laughs> Doctor, I need you to send me the hackers or something. I need backup. Okay, but just so you know, the jumping dimensions is dangerous. Are you sure? I don't have any other choice. There's way too many cyclones. I'm, I'm about to die, so we're going to have to rethink our strategy. Okay, I'm sending you the coordinates now. Good luck. Yo, oh, I'm in here. I'm in here. Yo, yo, I'm in here. Oh, yes, it's you guys. Thank you. Oh, I'm so happy to see you. We're risking a lot of jumping dimensions. Here, if this goes south, take this time to locator. It will tell us what time period you're in. All right, All right let's go. Jump portal dimension. Told you it wasn't safe. Uh, we gotta get out of here. How are we gonna get out of here? I'm breaking this. Oh, I'm running. Ooh. I'm running. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Look at all those fish. That's a lot of fish. Oh, oh no, I can't run. I can't run. Oh, is this food? Food. Oh, I got an onion. Oh, yes. Carrots. Wild carrots. Okay. Oh, I think we're safe. So, what do we do? You're a hacker. You can fix this, right? Yeah, we should be fine as long as we got the time geolocator. They should be here uh, any second now. Time geo. Oh, oh no. What do you mean, oh no? Oh no. Yeah, I could not believe. It. I guess when we went through the portal, it glitched just back a, a couple of thousand years. I was overwhelmed with so much at this point, I, I didn't know how to feel. Though, as terrifying as it was, it, it was also just as amazing to be able to witness the dinosaurs alive right in front of me. Like, this is sick. Can I ride it? I don't know. Try. Uh, hop on that uh, bad boy. It won't let me hop on it. Oh, look at this one. Hi, buddy. You look sick. This is crazy. Oh. Ah, this almost killed me. Feisty little fella. What'd you do? Poke him with a stick? I'm about to poke him with a stick. Flower. Whoa. You, you look very angry there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at this. Whoa. Fire. <laughs> fire. My question is how are we going to repopulate? I'll take one for the team. No! As the night set, we began to realize the severity of our situation. Without the time geolocator, Dr. Ivana Hamburger couldn't locate our position in time and space, and that's a huge problem. I mean, we were stuck alone with dinosaurs. And if my memory's correct, dinosaurs become extinct. After a couple of days of just trying to stay alive, I began to lose hope that help was ever coming. I mean, how would they know where to find us? Well, what the heck? Wait, what's going on? Hacker, tell me there's a chance they find us. This can't be our lives forever. There isn't much of a chance. Oh. But there is one. The odds of our survival, let alone the chance of us making it back to the future, were extremely low. And after everything that had happened, I'd be lying if I said there wasn't a major part of me that just wanted to feed myself to a T-Rex and call it a life. Really, it seemed like there was no way we were going to make it through this. But in a sense, that almost made it easier to continue. Knowing one day that I would hopefully be able to see my parents in that Aether Realm anyways. Why not just stay on the ride until it's over, I thought. I mean, sure, there's things like creepers, 
piranhas, zombies, things that make life way more difficult than it needs to be. But at the same time, there was so much to experience here in this Minecraft universe. Things like sunsets, fishing, swimming in the water, the feeling of a warm campfire after a long day of traveling. Oh, that's the best. You know, like even being able to hear all the cool sounds all the different animals make. Plus, I knew my parents wouldn't want me to just give up. I wasn't sure, but I imagined that they were somewhere up in that big blue sky watching over me. And I wanted to make them proud. And that was enough. Enough to keep pushing day after day after day, just making sure our basic needs were met. And before I even realized it, so many days had passed, I, I barely recognized the face in the mirror. And eventually, the pain of all the loss I had suffered turned into a faint whisper of gratitude and appreciation just for the opportunity to even exist and experience all this. The good, the bad, for the chance to become someone, affect and imprint a brief period in history that, no matter how small, will leave some sort of impact somewhere along the string of infinite moments we all know as reality. I had accepted my fate, and for the most part, there was peace. Uh, so, Eric. You know, it's it's been about 69 years, and, and I never thought to ask, but, uh, what's your birth username? Well, uh, yeah, so did my birth username. <laughs> oh, so did, huh? Yeah. So did. <laughs> 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 you look pasty like a whole turkey, you little pasty bucket. You're balder than that Dilapisaurus I saw when I was scrolling over there in that damn hills over there. I think the biggest lesson this all taught me was that nothing's permanent. And more importantly, keeping that in mind allows you to appreciate what you have while you still have it. And that goes for people too. Unfortunately, my hacker surviving buddy, he, he wasn't doing too well. And he hadn't been for some time now. Sadly, one morning I discovered that he had peacefully passed away in his sleep. I was distraught. Sody! Sody, buddy! What happened? Are you okay? Sony, wake up! Wake up, no! It's not your time yet, Sony! It's not your time yet, Sony! No! No! Oh my god! But I, I knew this day would come, eventually. So I, I buried his body and I said my goodbyes. And I knew my time was nearing as well, and well, so I decided to pack up some supplies and head inland. The plan was to not have a plan for once and let whatever happens happen. But then you, you won't believe what happens! Uh, what in the notch is this? What? A meteor? Oh my gosh, looks like it came from outer space. Oh, this is gonna take a while. Huh? What was this? Oh, <gasps> no way! Oh, no way! Yes! Behind us! It is the top geolocator! Yes! Yes! Oh, I, I hope it still works. <laughs> no signal! What do you mean, no signal? Oh, let me get my items. I couldn't get the time geolocator to work, but I couldn't believe I found it. Now, I was no hacker, but I figured climbing to the top of a mountain might get me a better oh, signal. Man, my back ain't like what it used to be, I'll tell you that. Oh, it's a snake. Come on! <laughs> what a stupid time geolocator! Oh. Jump through the portal, oh, hurry. Oh, oh, yeah! So, is that you? What? Is that I you? Know my name. Buddy, I'm so happy to Don't see you. Time. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Oh my gosh, you guys saved! I was saved! I guess when we jumped through the portal, it created a small pocket in time, and all those years stranded was only a matter of minutes in present time. How long was there for? Uh, I don't even know. I knew this would happen. I knew it, Josh. Are you okay? Uh, I, I aged a bit. Sody, do, do you even remember me? No. No. Don't oh. worry, I think I can fix this. Oh, I sure hope so. Luckily, the doctor was able to work up a reverse aging tick, effectively eliminating all the aging I had experienced. Sadly, Sody didn't remember anything I remembered, but it was it was nice seeing him alive, whether he remembered me or not. But once again, I, I had a mission to take out the Cyglum frequency transmitter and stop the Cyglum leader from destroying all organic life in the Minecraft universe. Okay, this time I promise the weapons do super big damage. You sure? You sure this time? Oh, I promise. Last I promise. time was, uh, oh, oh yeah. I'm good. This is the best tech you got, right? It's the very best tech. Alright. All right. Good luck, Chosen One. This is it. Good luck, Josh. I'll see you guys later. Thank you. Bye. Woo! Here we go! Pressing launch control. Oh, there he is. Uh, oh, 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 I almost messed that up. Okay. Uh, ouch. Yo, what's up, Mr. Portal Guy? Troll Guy? Oh, you again. I'm surprised you're still alive. <laughs> Me too. I, I need access to the portal again. Hopefully, this is the last time. Sure, sure. No problem. That'll be 64 blocks of gold, please. 64 blocks of gold? Are you insane? What, do you got a rock for a brain? Yes. Yeah, you must have a heart of stone, too. The world's ending and you're worried about getting gold? That's just ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. Oh, whatever, though. I'll be back. Oh, there's no way I have time to mine that much gold. 
I did not have enough time to mine 64 blocks of gold, so I had to come up with a plan. That's my chance. Get y'all, Joe. I'll see you later. Yahoo! Okay, so I just gotta somehow kill that dragon and go to the frequency tower and disable it while not getting shot by all of those cyclones. Uh, that should be easy. Oh no, don't shoot me. Alright, let's make our way down here. I remember my special ability to morph into anything I kill, and so I snuck up on a worker cyclone and right, took him out. Sneak up on him, try and kill him. Oh, he's getting attacked. Oh, what are these things? Okay, let me hide over here. Right now, let's see if I can transform. Yes, it worked. I'm a psycho. <gasps> yes, okay. Now, hopefully, they shouldn't recognize me and they won't attack me. Yes, it's working. They're not attacking. Okay, perfect. What's up, guys? I'm just a robot like you. Beep boop, beep boop, beep boop, ba, ba, beep boop. All right, let's try and kill this dragon. And we got to go up that tower and disable that thing somehow. Cue epic dragon battle montage. Woohoo! Oh, I can shoot him. Let's go. No, no, no. Woo! No! <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, 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 yes. There we go. We got it. All right, one left. Can we shoot it? Oh, yes. Oh, this thing has range. Let's go. That was the last one. Okay, here we go. All right, just me versus the dragon. All right, there he is. I'm shooting him. Die, you stupid dragon. Boom. Oh, this one's doing a ton of damage. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, uh, we did it. We killed it. Oh, this gun poisoned it. Oh, my gosh. Okay. All right, now we got to get to that tower. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. This tower is huge. How am I going to get up there? The frequency transmitter tower is a heavily armored and secure structure. As long as the tower is on and running, all of these cyclones will stay mind controlled by the cyclone leader. Now, I just have to somehow figure out how to get on top of it and save it. How in the world am I going to get up there? Wait a sec. Wait a second. I can turn into a dragon. Oh, oh, I'm a dragon. Let's go. I can fly. Hold on. I got to get used to this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait. Oh, yo. Doing it. All right, let's get to the top. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, that must be it right there. Throw some bombs, baby. There we go. There we go. All right, let's land right here. Go back into a human. Oh, oh, yes. I'm in. Okay. All right, let's be careful. Oh, this must be the block I need to use the drill on that L1 gave me. Let's see if it works. Come on. Come on. Yes. Okay. Okay, here's the power system. If we destroy this, in theory, the transmission signal should be cut and stopped. Huh? I've been expecting you. Oh, well, here I am. You should be ashamed of yourself. How can you live with yourself doing what you're doing? How? Be quiet. You have no idea what this world has put me through. It's only fair that I get my vengeance. Uh, you're a coward. I... Uh. What's going on? What is this? Oh, Josh. <laughs> I've been one step ahead of you this whole time. You probably don't recognize me. Here, let me take off my mask. What? Siren? But there's no way. Why, why would you do all this? You killed my, my family. <laughs> you, you killed my family. No, Josh. You what? Did. You killed all of those people. You killed your no, family. No. What are you talking all about? Of this, you no, no. created it in your head. None of this is real. No, there's, there's no way. Why, why would I believe you? You're trying to trick me. No. That's why I brought you <gasps> And there I was, once again, faced with a choice. Now, I had no reason at this point to trust Siren, but one thing I've learned is to trust my gut. And my whole life, I felt like something, something was off. And so, I decided to... Pull the... Once again to Dragon City for sponsoring this video. Download the game right now by clicking the link in the description or scan the QR code to get a special free starter pack of 15,000 food, 30,000 gold, and a Flame Knight Dragon.